uh, a topic from last week. The Mario Party 5 Mario plush that was on eBay and quote-unquote sold for $10,000. Well, of course, it didn't sell for $10,000, as we all could have guessed. And the private message that the seller received, well, I got an offer for $1,000. As I also said last week, there's no way that's going to be paid for, and it was not paid for. So as a result, that $10,000 Mario is back on eBay. Um, I think it had a duration of six days. It's I think it has four days left or so. And it's currently up to $100, which I think is significantly less than it was already at when it had four days uh, previously, during the first time of its listing. But in the same breath, um, it's probably going to get stupid high. Not as high as $10,000, but I'm going to guess probably like five, 500 which, you know, 500 versus $10,000, that's a big difference. But when you think about Mario Party 5 Mario plushes, like... Luigi, you know, 500 is like his peak nowadays. So Mario getting 500, yeah, he'll reach that, but it's not going to get paid for. It's absurd. So, I mean, I guess what else is there to really say about this? But I just wanted to let you guys know that this kind of shenanigans, it, it just never ends. It just never ends. And I'm going to throw this out there as well, just to get, let you guys be aware of it. And anybody else who you think would benefit from me telling you this, uh, because it is it is an issue, this Mario Party 5 plush scalping and all the shenanigans of fake bidders and all this stupid stuff. So I was watching a Mario Party 5 Mario plush on a Japanese auction site today, and I was thinking about maybe bidding on it, but I'm like, you want to know what? I'm not going to bother. Turns out it ended up selling for $80, and I'm like, okay, I wasn't going to pay 80 anyway, so whatever. Um, let's just say that the winner of this auction I was watching on the Japanese auction site, beat out one of our other good scalper reseller friends, which I was very happy about so that they couldn't flip it and resell it. So I'm like, it's probably going to go to a good home. You know, it's probably going to go to a good home. And then guess what? The same exact picture from the auction from this morning that ended on the Japanese auction site is on American eBay. If you search Mario Party 5 plush, it's a $250 um, I don't know if it's buy it now or best offer or just buy it now, but it's a $250 plush. It's coming from Japan. It's the exact same pictures as the one that I saw earlier and didn't win for $80. Now, a couple things are going on here, so I'm not going to totally throw this listing under the bus because I don't know exactly if the Japanese one was paid for. It may not have been paid for, and this is the seller maybe listing it on American eBay or something thinking they can get more money for it, um, you know, maybe, I don't know, maybe someone just stole the pictures or something, I, because it's really hard to, to say for certain that this is the same person that won it, and then they're flipping it, because they don't even have it yet, that's the thing, that if this person who won it was flipping it, they literally won it this morning, they don't even have it yet, so for them to have the audacity to steal pictures from an auction they already won, you know, I mean, that's just beyond just scummy. So I, I I really would hope no one would stoop to that level and do that, but I want to throw it out there that this is a shady Mario Party 5 flush. And regardless, don't pay $250 for it, so don't do that anyway. But, like, this is a common occurrence, and now it's happening on the international scene, and it's really bad for the Mario Party 5 plush plushes, I guess. And also, just like I said last week as well, Video game Mario plush collecting as a whole, or I was said that kind of weird, but like this is just going to increase the price of future Mario plush auctions and everything. And do you want to know what? Do do you got do you guys know what? Guess what? I just thought of this right now. When before the ten thousand dollar Mario Party five listing? When before that one did we even see a small Mario? Because this is the small one. When did we even see a small Mario go? for $250, like, be, or be listed for $250. It's never been that high before. So this is more testament that that $10,000 listing is going to plague these plushes for the next few months. And that is really, really sad. So be careful when bidding on these plushes or buying them. Make sure that the price is fair and that this the people you buy it from aren't scalpers or uh, flippers or resellers or anything like that. You know, if you can, if you can avoid, well, most of the time their prices are ridiculously absurd anyway, so you probably wouldn't even want to buy from them. But like, just in any case, 
be wary of it and you know that um that happened that that happened so